Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. It is uh, December the 20. I believe the 21st. <laughs> it is Sunday morning. And uh, you know, I've been making videos for year and almost two years. Yeah, almost two years. And uh, I started back in, uh, I think, late 2013. And, um, you know, I was just uh, a new, unexperienced, inexperienced, <laughs> and um, kind of... Uh, going all over the place and then I try to streamline and Alhamdulillah I think I'm doing more effectively now uh, <clears throat> the what is gonna be what I'm gonna be doing from now on it is instead of sitting there and you know just bringing all uh, the negative uh, uh, stuff that is happening and being critical uh, I'm just going to make videos about alternative for how to go and try to make a difference for yourself and others uh, uh, by giving some information about how to go about filing for your uh, uh, CalFresh or general relief or cash aid or uh, child support case or what have you you know you help us and that's what the you know Institute of South London American Muslims is gonna be doing it's like a community center working with everyone there is no exception and uh, by doing uh, helping them with all the application process and so on and so forth and then go and fight cases for uh, the recipients that is they been uh, uh, done wrong by the state and the federal government branches or departments. Um, that's basically what it is. Now the other the other thing I'm uh, gonna do I'm gonna also uh, start getting uh, you know uh, events from locally state on a state level and internationally about the politics and the how the the war against Muslims, Islam and Muslims are conducted to remove them from the scene and make people afraid of uh, the only, well, not only Muslims, but people that they are trying to bring about, to bring changes and, uh, you know, uh, do for humanity. Uh, <clears throat> uh, I was watching the, the video of uh, uh, Rachel, Rachel Corey, uh, that she was bulldozed down by the, the Zionist uh, terrorist organization in uh, Hebron or uh, West Bank somewhere uh, because she was standing on the front of a bulldozer uh, to protect a doctor uh, family uh, him uh, uh, I don't know if she was a female I think but the video is there I mean there is you know it's over all over the internet now the uh, violence gun violence namely in the United States let's let's not go far and if anyone is gonna tell me that there is not a war in the streets of the United States of America they really got some issues the 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 smoking good stuff <laughs> all right violence in this country is being the theme And it's been a long, we targeted the youth. 
in the beginning, there was movies and, you know, and uh, Hollywood and, you know, from the early 1900s. Well, they didn't start that early, but it, and violence, but, you know, media. And then late 70s, beginning of the 80s was video games or arcades. It's all about violence, you know, blowing people up and blood and body parts flying everywhere and destruction of buildings and, you know. That is what has been happening. And then we have the mass shooting students going to school. It started in Colorado, uh, Colin Powell, or whatever you call it, back in the uh, 90s. I think it also was the first incident. Maybe there was before that, but it was postal thing. Um, and then the gun lobbyists and you know, gun laws and so on and so forth. Well, let's, let's look at Let's look at statistics and the actuality, life events that there. You know, we don't have to go anywhere and the terrorists want to kill us and they, they, they hate our freedom and we want to protect ourselves. You know, and it, 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 it sounds so stupid that a candidate, you know, a, a presidential candidate like uh, Trump, uh, oh, we want to protect ourselves from uh, the. <laughs> it sounds so. It sounds like Charles play. They playing in the neighborhood. I don't want to, you know, playing, uh, you know, uh, uh, what do you call it? Thieves and uh, soldiers or whatever you call. Askar wa Haramaya, people from Egypt, please trans uh, translate. Uh, oh, they want to kill us and they want to destroy our country. They, uh, we have to stop and go to the mosques and uh, destroy them and uh, limit their freedom to pray and learn the Quran and so on and so forth. Do it! <laughs> I'm sorry. Now, the, the violence thing. Uh, I will including this video, uh, some of, uh, but there is too many of them, uh, about the statistics uh, who, uh, where the killing and the violence is coming from and why. Now, the other thing I wanted to bring to the attention, it has become now in every subject, everything, you Google anything, and before you get to the the nitty-gritty of the main subject and the solutions and so on, you know, the sincere effort to deal with this certain problem or issue, it's nearly impossible to find out. You will get jerked around, dizzy, everybody try to sell you some, everybody try to donate here, donate there, dot com, dot org, dot, 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 dot. It's unbelievable. Everyone, and it's done by corporate America and their, you know, and the people that they are in the government actually to con and continue to keep the status quo. It is, it's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Now, and I'm not saying this is my own experience. Just to go and do things. Start finding out. Start finding out what's the truth and what's reality and what's not. What's a, it's a mirage or an illusion or, or a brainwash to control our minds and to have the masses worship this shaitan party, Hezbollah shaitan. That's it. It is, it is very obvious. It is very clear. We just have to let our mind work a little bit and leave everything aside. And you will see it. Okay, now... I am going to include this 
a video and also I'm gonna have to reference ayat from Al Quran Al Karim. And I'm not doing that to be a scholar or an imam or what have you. I am doing that to show everyone how easy and how doable it is to follow the teaching of the Quran and to open your heart for the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so we can, you know, at least, you know, <laughs> gain and win this life and the hereafter. Mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Live here, you know, hayatun. We accept and we be pleased with and then we go, go earn the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the hereafter or the day of judgment. It is not complicated and that for anyone with basic reading abilities in any language you could understand and study and follow the teaching of the Quran. Wallahi and the Rasulullah Okay. تركت فيكم ما أن تمسكتم به لن تضلوا بعدي أبدا كتاب الله وسنتي كتاب الله وسنتي everything is there okay now why this is for everyone because the message of Islam it is not for a certain group of people وما أرسلناك إلا رحمة للعالمين العالمين الجن والإنس and I'm gonna stop there because again I am not an imam and I don't wanna go in tafsir of the Quran because I have no clue يعني استغفر الله if I'm making any mistakes but this is والله أعلم okay now I am gonna start doing this and then let me go back to this uh, what <clears throat> the question does the Quran early uh, really contain dozen of verses promoting violence and the answer is their summary answer and then Old Testament uh, verses of violence and then you know it's it's a very informative and everything is from the Quran okay and the ayat is right there so I'm gonna include this in this video so please you know just to get the link and you know in your leisure in your own time just everybody has a computer there we have it and but we're going everywhere with you know you don't we don't talk to each other anymore we don't everybody's you know have their own phone or iphone or ipad or what 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 you know and they go in there and you're doing this well let's let's just do something good for ourselves <laughs> devote maybe what 20 minutes or less a day to <laughs> to learn about life and how we can please our creator allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and earn mercy that's it okay so i'm gonna include this just gonna, gonna I'm sorry I'm gonna put the link with this video uh, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bestow mercy upon humanity wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh